now Sunday the 25th. Um, we're exactly six days um, after they spawn. They spawn on the 19th, and all of the fry are uh, free swimming now. And it's crazy to see just the swarm of fry. I didn't expect we'd get this many to even become free swimming at this point, but uh, they look really healthy. Uh, continue just cleaning, doing water changes, um, and feeding them. The first thing that we're going to feed our angel babies is some vinegar eels. Now we bought this culture. Um, we bought this culture from someone um, in our fish club. It's basically just vinegar with a sponge in it, um, um, with some of the mother in it, and we can put a couple apple slices in there. They're not essential, um, but basically we harvest that. We get the vinegars, um, vinegar eels um, mixed in with like mainly water, so like maybe like a couple milliliters of the vinegar eels with like a rest fresh water and then we feed that to the baby angels um, however the vinegar that's there's still vinegar in that water and so we need to put we put some uh, baking soda in it and that kind of dissolves the vinegar out uh, because eventually that will build up um, and it eventually kill the fry if you have too much vinegar in there it's a really small pinch of it um, and this is really helpful to do this anytime we feed uh, vinegar eels after we put them in the fresh water um, we harvest them right around the edge of the uh, container where the water is. Um, that's where they congregate the most, um, as well as just along the surface and the top. Uh, but mainly around the edges where they really congregate. Um, you can see those are they are hitting those eels. Good. Which is uh, essential for me to be eating. And we also put some baby brown shrimp in there, not necessarily expecting them to eat it, but as soon as they start eating it, they'll we're very confident um, that the fry will make it. The adults appear to be cleaning off the slate again. Um, and if they spawn again, we plan to uh, let them try to raise them on their own and until they get one uh, a batch they've raised on their own we'll uh, keep them in here but once they raise a batch of angels on their own then we'll probably move them into the big tank or someone